Hey guys! Guess what we just got back from? It was incredible. So fun. We went to the uh, Ronald McDonald um, charity heroes event. Heroes for Heroes. Heroes for Heroes. At the uh, Center Studios in Los Angeles. Yeah, we thought it was only like going to be Supergirl. The Supergirl, they tweeted out that it was going to be McCard Brooks, who didn't end up being there for some reason. No, he wasn't there. Um, Katie McGrath, which is the real reason we went. And Terry Hatcher, which we thought was going to be awesome, too. Um, but it ended up being, like, a lot of Team Flash. And just a huge table of cast just from huge. all four shows. People just kept walking in. And it, was, <laughs> it was incredible. It was, it was incredible. And, uh, and uh, I, uh, Andrew Kreisenberg, I think I'm saying that right, he was just, like, walking around, like, casually all day. And I got to talk to him a little bit at one point. Um, I thought my camera was off, but it wasn't. So our conversation is actually recorded. But it's only audio because I didn't have it, like, pointing at him. Right. We thought that would be rude. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I didn't have the camera on him, but I do have the audio. I ended up asking him um, about Checkmate and Lena and stuff, which he he wouldn't confirm or deny, but the look he gave me kind of confirmed it. Yeah. Like, he almost seemed impressed that I asked him. Yeah. <laughs> it was a little chaotic. You know, there wasn't that many people there. I'd say maybe, like, 200 people altogether but they didn't have a lot of people uh running the event yeah and so the line for autographs got a little out of control and we almost didn't get in and at one point i ended up just kind of like going underneath the casually casually like <laughs> they cut the line off like uh right before us and uh we'd been waiting like two and a half hours and i ended up like just like pushing forward and uh we got in anyway uh, we kind of like, that's what you have to do in life. Yeah. You just push forward. There were actually these two little girls behind me with their parents, and they were like four or five years old, and they were dressed as Supergirl, and they were like devastated. So I got in. Uh, Kara didn't get in. No. Well, kind I got of. sort of. She got in at the very end, but some of the cast had left the table. Yeah. And, um, I ended up taking those two little girls, like, I, the parents, like, thankfully let me, and I was like, just let... She used them as a wingman. Yeah, I was like, just let them come with me, and, um, because I'd already been in, and I was like, oh, they're with me, and so we got the kids in. I think you can hear the audio of me being like, I'll take your kids. <laughs> and, like, and I was like, I'm You have not... such a trusting face. I guess so. <laughs> what, what is really unfair is the Flash, a.k.a. Grant Gustin, walks out of, like, they were just, like, really chill, Probably because, like, the the crowd was really cool, you know. But he just, like, walked out into everybody. And then Kim was just like, oh, hey. And he was just like, oh, hey. Nice to meet you. Hey, let's take a selfie. And we took a selfie. Like, standing in line. And he's just, like, looking across the table at her. And she just, they just had a conversation with Started each other. Probably, it's like he was bored because they weren't moving the line they very well. Not. I mean, that's why everyone didn't get through the line they weren't moving it very well so literally at one point we were just like face to face and he was just like what's up and i was like what's up dude yeah. i was like how you doing and he, he was, was like i'm he's good so nice. he's just like super nice they were like, all like so nice just so down to earth to have just a normal conversation like it's really awesome i mean katie mcgrath what an amazing oh person gosh. like i don't think i ever saw her not smiling at all. But we were talking about how it was so funny. It was literally like she was like ready for cameras to roll on Supergirl. She's just like the most gorgeous human being and she just looks that way all the time. She's she just looked like flawless. Lena. You know like how you meet someone sometimes and they don't usually look like their character, you know, like she's she has her hair down beautiful. or anything. Literally. She had it up in a bun too. <laughs> Literally, she looked like Lena Luthor. Like yeah. she was about to shoot with the red lipstick, and I th I was like, did like she do she it on purpose? Maybe. Oh my god, she was just so nice. I kept watching her interact with people because that oh was the most gosh. entertaining thing to watch her with other people. She like loves her dog too. People kept being like, I have a dog, and she'd be like, Do you want to see my dog? And she'd pull out oh, yeah, her, her phone. Her phone, like I her think, screensaver. I'm sure somebody got video of it, but her screensaver is her and her dog, just like, like pressed against the friggin' lens the video of me meeting uh katie mcgrath you, you hear that sentence that just came out of my mouth yeah i met katie mcgrath and you i like talked to full her full on had a conversation with yeah. her so the video when i was shooting like 
I'm very forward looking people in the eyes when they're talking to me, so I, I wasn't looking I through. Be rude. I don't want to yeah. be rude. I wasn't looking through my camera lens, so at some point my camera is kind of. I'm just not looking at it. I mean, I was just like, I was so focused on them that it's a little. Hopefully, you guys don't hate it. You but, definitely. Sorry. Yeah, I think it's good. I think it's still good. Yeah. Yes, this is us. We are this way. There's a lot of people. You'll be back next season.
in line. Kara? Kara, and how do you spell her name? Nah, uh, with a K instead of a C. Oh. K A R A. K A R A. Yeah. Fair, that's fair. Fair to hate yeah, And she's Kara, not Kara. She hates that. And now Supergirl's ruined it for her. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. Yes, thank you. I did not. Nice meeting you. This is you. Enjoy the rest of your break. Thanks. You too. Hi. Hi. How's it going? Good, thank you. My sister got cut off in line, so that's for her. And then my name's Kim. Awesome, dude. Thanks so much. Very welcome. I just met Katie McGrath. Me too. Kind of. Kind of. Yeah. It's The event was kind of uh, unorganized. Very event. unorganized. And so they cut the line off and we didn't think we were going to get in, but we kind of pushed We kind of pushed at the Look. end there and got everything. Terry Hatcher so we signed Terry. my Superman poster. My yeah. Logan Clark. Logan Clark. <laughs> Katie was amazing. You'll see the footage. She's yes. amazing. She, she was, was so... I don't, I don't think she stopped smiling the whole she's time. She's the nicest human being on this planet. Nicest person I've ever met. <laughs> she's amazing. <laughs> Oh, and then we got these done. I don't know if you can see them with Supergirl. Yeah. Those are pretty cool. We got that done. And uh, it was really cool. They had posters from the um, four-part crossover that they gave us all. And so we got we got those signed. Let me... So here's the poster they gave us all for the event, which is pretty awesome. So Terry Hatcher signed mine there. And then... Um, Katie McGrath signed there. Awesome. And then I got uh, Candace uh, Patterson right there. And Grant. And Danielle. Then we got uh, Brandon Roth from Legends. A.K.A. Superman. <laughs> A.K.A. Superman. Yeah. <laughs> and then Kara's. It's here. Terry, Katie. Right? So, yeah. Alright. Alright, yeah. So, overall, like, a super cool day. An amazing day we had. Uh, and then, of course, we got to watch the, the finale. <laughs> and uh, the crowd for the finale was crazy. They were it so was awesome. loud. It was loud. Every time somebody came on screen, anytime anything major happened, it was loud. So, we're thinking about making another reaction video to actually making it was a reaction really, video. really, really, really hard to hear. Because, I mean, we missed a lot of dialogue and all that. I mean, obviously we know what happens oh, all the way through. Oh, it was fun to watch an episode with that hyped up of a crowd. It really was. You should have heard... I don't know if any... Uh, obviously, so much stuff is leaking, but when Katie McGrath, when Lena Luther came on screen the first time... Oh, my God. It, it was, was deafening. The, it was the loudest I've ever heard. It was so <laughs> loud. But I think that's awesome because Andrew was in the crowd. He stayed and watched the episode with us. So for him to hear the kind of support that the fans have for certain characters, yeah. I think is amazing. He's going to be like, oh, you know, I'm sure he knows how much the fans love her, but he really knows now. <laughs> so yeah, it was so loud. But yeah, I think we're going to make a reaction video for tonight's episode, uh, even though we've already seen it, just because we missed a bunch yeah. of, of little bit of dialogue here and there and... If you uh if you like our video, like and subscribe and comment. And yeah. We love we actually, talking to you guys. We actually do a lot of uh this kind of stuff all the time. Like we I'm surprised that the the that the finale got leaked the way it did because we were actually on the set of Pitch Perfect Three and we haven't been able to say anything yeah. for months. Yeah, they like made a sign and, and it doesn't it doesn't took pictures of us. It doesn't come out until Dece until December. So, literally, if we can go that long without talking about Pitch Perfect 3 and the things we've seen, how can people not wait 24 hours to talk about the Supergirl finale? I don't understand. There was, like, no security there, though. So. It's, it's crazy. Yeah, uh, let us know uh, what you guys think of the video. And, um, yeah, leave us some comments and like, subscribe if you haven't yet, if you'd like to. 
and we'll see you tomorrow with our reaction video. Yay! Alright, bye! bye.